elevation. Power 95.3 Orlando's number one for commercial free hip hop. It's SD and it's Thursday, Thursday. And if you've kind of caught on by now, every Thursday, you know, we got to take a break from the guys and just kind of chit chat. So, ladies, I wanted to know about secrets. Uh, this is definitely an interesting topic because I've been getting some, uh, you know, responses. Now, I'm looking at Facebook and it's I see Catherine. She goes, if you keep secrets, then you don't have a good relationship. So she decided not to deveal, uh, you know, divulge anything of hers. But she's saying, if you have them, why are you even with someone? So I want to hear your opinion, ladies. Any deep, dark secrets? 407-295-9595. <laughs> from my fiance mm -hmm. it's, it's kind of like a, a blackmailing type thing and uh -oh. so my fiance has never really had a dad figure but there's this one guy that he sees as his dad so it's not really his dad but my secret would be that i'm sleeping with him you're kidding no oh my gosh i'm i'm sorry i'm in shock so are you trying to stop sleeping with the guy and then marry him? Are you still going to stay sleeping with him? What is your plan? My plan right now, like me and my fiance are having some real big issues and everything because I caught him cheating on me. She uh. like, he hasn't, he hasn't caught me with his quote unquote father figure. Um. And I caught him cheating. So we're having some problems right now. But my plan is to break it off with my fiance and get with his quote unquote <sighs> father figure. Wow, so you're going to go public and get with this? Oh, my gosh, you sorry. I'm like, you blowed my mind. I appreciate you calling in and having the guts to share that with me. I really do. And I'm dying to hear how this turns out. Just keep me posted. Okay. It's the ladies' room. Good morning, Ashley. Good morning. How are you guys doing? Hey, I'm doing really well. Thank you so much. I wanted to know about the secrets, like something that you've been withholding from your guy. So we've been together seven years since I was 17. And um, back when we first started dating, it was maybe like in the first five months. Mm -hmm. um, we had unfortunately had unprotected sex. And so um, I basically aborted a pregnancy <gasps> um, early on. And to this day, he doesn't know, and we're still together, which is why I kind of regret it. But I know that when it's time for us to have a family, we will. He doesn't know that you had no, an abortion. It was, it was too early, and he'll never know. Um, it's something that I have to live with. Really? And you'll never, ever tell him no matter how long you guys are together? It's been seven years. Never. I'm too afraid it'll break his heart. Oh, my gosh. That's insane. Well, hopefully he doesn't hear this because that is super serious. I mean, that could break you guys up if he finds out. Uh, let's not talk about that. <laughs> wow. All right, Ashley. Well, thank you for calling in. I'm so sorry to hear that. I know that must have been rough. Thanks but for I... listening, you guys. Yeah, and no. Love you guys. No problem. We love you so much, too, and I appreciate you calling in the ladies' room. Thank you. This one's from Metro West. Good morning, Claudia. So what's the secret you're keeping? So I'm seeing this guy, and we were on, like, our third date, uh -huh. and he loves long hair. Loves long hair. So I have hair extensions. I have really short hair, so I feel like, you know, what if he doesn't like me because he's always complimenting <gasps> he loves my long hair, and I kind of don't want to break the bad news that, you know, I have, I have like, a bob. <laughs> you have super short hair and extensions. Listen, I'm not going to lie. I wear clip-in extensions every once in a while because it's fun. Mm -hmm. I mean, you make your exactly. hair longer. So you're nervous if you admit to this guy that your hair is actually short and not the long, dark hair that he thinks you have, that he if may I be turned off? I think if I take my, my clips out, he's going to just walk out the door on me. Girl, hey. I think you should do it in the middle of dinner at a public restaurant. Just whip him out and say, look, here's the real me. Do you love me or not? Well, I'll be calling you if I do it in real <laughs> Okay, cool. Yeah, let me know. But I would just say rip out the extensions and admit to him that your hair is fake. <laughs> Okay. Thank you, You're welcome, sweetie. Now, I'm looking at this Facebook message from Brianna. I'm not going to say her real name, but she's admitting that she has a third nipple. Can I say that? So I am reading it here. But after a few dates with her guy, they haven't hit second base yet. So she's nervous that if he finds out when she hits second base, he'll run away like the rest of the guys have for her whole life. Okay. So anyways, that is the message and the secret that Brianna is holding. Thank you for sharing that, ladies. And if you want to let me know, let's keep chatting. It's so fun. Power953.com. TJ, this hickory steak and bacon flat melt is epic. Seriously, it deserves its own app. 